Hello and welcome to this video tutorial on how to do a time lapse with a Canon Reflex and the need of EOS utility software, EOS. In this video, I will show you how to set up your camera, connect it to your computer through a USB cable, and use the software EOS Utility to create stunning time lapse videos. EOS Utility is a good software for, for example, this camera, which is mine, the EOS EOS 4000D, uh, and this is the camera that I own that doesn't have the support for a remote shutter release or an intervalometer that are the preferred devices for doing this. Uh, so we need to remote control the camera using the computer. And the computer will set a timer for uh, regular uh, shots of the camera. We can set the camera in manual mode so that uh, the, we get to customize the shot as much as we want. So this is the cable we need, which is a mini USB uh, to USB-A cable. This is the mini USB end. And uh, we can put this end in the Canon EOS uh, 4000D EOS. 4000D, uh, opening here and putting this inside this way. This this other entry is the HDMI mini cable, but we just need this. This is to communicate with the computer and make funny things like time lapse uh, or use uh, your reflex as a webcam. We put this in and we put the other hand inside our computer. This is the other hand. In my case, I bought the first cable from Amazon. We plug the USB cable inside the computer. OK. And then we enable the EOS utility app. In this case, we open the EOS app. And now we can connect a EOS camera. In this case, we just need to turn on our USB camera. For example, now I've set it in manual mode. This is the app uh, interface. Here we can do different things. First of all, we need to put the manual focus instead of automatic focus with our camera because automatic focus is uh, dangerous for a time lapse because maybe for one second of the final time lapse we can have a foreground object in focus and uh, the next second we have a background object in focus with the focus shifting faster between those two objects and thus it creates a bad effect very bad for the eye so after setting our camera in manual and learning how to use manual i hope you enjoyed this video and learned the basics of time lapse and learn how to make a time lapse with an EOS 4000d thanks for watching